Yeah. Hey, hey kids. kids! Hope you guys have had an amazing week. We're so excited to do another Bible story and some worship with you guys. Okay guys, now we're going to join in with worship. Our first song we're doing relates directly to our lesson because we're talking about how Jesus loves the little children and that's the song we're going to do. Jesus loves the little children, all the children of the world. Red and yellow, black and white, they are precious in his sight. Jesus loves the little children of the world. One more time. Jesus loves the little children, all the children of the world. Red and yellow, black and white, they are precious in his sight. Jesus loves the little children of the world. Awesome job, guys. For our next song, we're going to be doing Jesus Loves Me. Everybody get ready. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong, they are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me, the Bible tells me so. Okay guys, this time everybody needs to have a lot of space so we can move because we're going to do Father Abraham, so just copy after me. Father Abraham had many sons, and many sons had Father Abraham, for I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm. Father Abraham had many sons, and many sons had a father Abraham. For I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm. Father Abraham had many sons, and many sons had a father Abraham. For I am one of them. And so are you. So let's all praise the Lord. Right arm, left arm, right foot. Father Abraham had many sons. And many sons had a father Abraham. For I am one of them. And so are you. So let's all praise the Lord. Right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot. Father Abraham had many sons. And many sons had a father, Abraham, for I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot, chin up, chin down. Father Abraham had many sons, many sons had a father, Abraham, for I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot, chin up, chin down, turn around. Father Abraham had many sons, and many sons had a father Abraham, for I am one of them, and so are you. So let's all praise the Lord, right arm, left arm, right foot, left foot, chin up, chin down, turn around, sit down! Oh, good job everybody. Now we're going to head into our lesson and so we're going to sing our five finger song. I have five fingers on each hand, ten fingers all together, I put then this way when I pray, ten fingers all together. Let's pray, guys. Dear Jesus, we thank you so much for this amazing day and that we get to spend time with you in worship and hearing an awesome story about you. We ask all of this in your precious name and everybody says, Amen! Thank you, Teacher Gabby, for another great worship time. Well, kids, today I get to pick the story for you guys. I know we've been learning a lot about Jesus' miracles, but I think that one of the best stories in the Bible is a super, super simple one that sometimes people look over it once in a while. 
It's in a book of the Bible called Matthew. And we're going to be in chapter 19 if your mommies or daddies want to help you find it in a Bible. So, the story goes like this. It says in the Bible, in chapter 19, verse 13, Then people brought little children to Jesus for him to place his hands on them and pray for them. But the disciples rebuked them. That means that they sent them away and said, No, don't bring your children here. Jesus said, Let the little children come to me and do not hinder them. That means stop them. For the kingdom of heaven belonged to such as these. When he had placed his hands on them, he went on from there. Very short little story that we can find in the Bible, but it's very, very important. How many of you are pretty little children still? Maybe you're this many, two or three or four or even five. But guess what? You're all still little children. And Jesus, even though he was this big and important and very powerful teacher, loved the little children just as much as he loved everybody else. Now the disciples didn't want the children anywhere around Jesus. They thought that they would be a bother. Do you guys sometimes, maybe without meaning to, bother your parents or your older siblings? It happens sometimes, but Jesus loves the little children just like your parents love you and your siblings love you. Even though sometimes they may not always want you around, Jesus is very different from that. He always wants you around and he loves you so, so very much. It said in that passage that the kingdom of heaven belongs to such as these. Children have such an amazing heart and an amazing faith that allows them to believe in things that they cannot see. It makes it so much easier. And Jesus loves them for their faith. Their faith is amazing in the way that they believe. Just like you guys. You guys have such amazing imaginations and faith that you can believe in Jesus so easily now. But Jesus is always going to be there for you and he loves you so very much. He loves you so much that he died on the cross for our sins, even though you weren't even born yet. You weren't even born and Jesus already loved you. He formed you in your mother's tummy and he created you to be absolutely beautiful and perfect in God's eyes. So remember whenever you think that Jesus is too big to even remember you or think about you, or let alone love you, Jesus is always thinking of you. And he says that you should come to him with any of your problems, no matter how big or how small they might be. So let's pray right now and let's thank Jesus for being so loving towards all the little children. Dear Lord, we thank you for this day and for this time that you've given us. Thank you so much for being such a big and powerful God. And thank you so much for always loving all people, no matter how little or small or big they may be. We love you and we thank you so much. In Jesus' name we pray and everybody said as loud as they could, Amen! Thank you guys. Thank you guys for joining us again this week. And remember, just like we learned in our lesson, Jesus loves you. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. My turn. Yeah. <laughs>